What is up you guys, you're watching Sergio's Secret, and before I get started with today's video, if you can please give this video a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and today we are at Dillard's, and they're doing the additional 40% off. Um, no exclude. usually I think Thursdays is for card holders, I don't have a Dillard's credit card, but I hear it's open to the public, so I'm so excited. I thought I was running poquito tarde, because I was like, oh my god, Sergio, ya purate, 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 because I want to go see, look at everything, but they actually open at 11, and it is currently 10.55. I thought they open at 10, but apparently they open at 11, which was absolutely perfect timing, and yeah guys, I have so much to talk about. I feel like I have not done a vlog since I come back from LA. Yeah, this is my first one since I since I came back from LA and I still haven't even finished the LA vlogs. I've just had so much things on my plate right now. Um, and I'm just, I'm going through the gigs, but I just literally have like one more week or maybe under 10 days and then I will be back to my normal self. Um, just because I have so much, so much, so much, so much things on my plate. But after I get everything situated, everything will be better and I have some announcements coming up pretty, pretty soon. So I wanna say thank you, I wanna say thank you to everybody that's been holding up on there on me, has been watching the few videos that I have been posting and don't worry, we'll be putting some great content for fall and winter because Christmas is right around the corner. It really, really is la mera verdad uh, because it's September basically is about to be over. November, just October, November and then December those days in December like the 1st to the 24th literally go super 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 fast so I'm so excited to see how the holiday is going to be like especially now that I have more of a YouTube channel and I want to see how the content will go and I'm just super excited and excited for the future there's a lot of things happening and honestly I wouldn't change anything for the world so this one right here this one's a little bit more of a drive out now um it's about <laughs> maybe 30 40 minutes and this one's the one that has Marc Jacobs handbag so I want to see if there's a really sickening Marc Jacobs handbag that I could purchase and maybe I could buy oh my god I, okay <laughs> I thought I forgot a mask but I have some right here I, that's why I always keep disposable ones just because in case if I forget it because I, I like I have them right here um, I'm wearing a simple Anina Bing shirt I'm wearing some redone jeans that I got from Nordstrom Rack and I'm wearing my Chanel 19 um, Today, I've, this has been like my non-stop handbag. I've been obsessed with her. Guys, but I'll talk to you guys when we're at Dillard's. And I cannot wait to tell you guys everything. Uh, hopefully, we'll find some good stuff here. Okay, guys. All the moms are beating me. I guess I'm not hit. But yeah, I'm wearing that. I just wore something super casual. Because it's probably going to be the only time I'm going to be out outside. Because then I'm going to be home doing a bunch of phone calls. And getting my life together. But I'm super, super excited. But hopefully we find some more Jacob's handbags. Because that's what we came here for. 40% off. But I think they have them in the back. More Jacob's bags. There's not really a lot right there. This is what I came here for. Yeah. Apparently it started yesterday and I guess I missed out. They have these ones here. <gasps> they have this little tabby. And 40% off. Mm -hmm. And they have this gray one. 245. And it's the 40% off. This little floral tabby, the same one. This little nudie color 227 this kind of burgundy color 227 and then all these coach bags are 105 so they have they'll be like 60 dollars um the white ones i think this one would be like a little bit more 150 from 250 coach face mask guidance This one's cute with a little dinosaur on it, with like the little Rexy on it. That one's on sale. We don't have any Marc Jacobs bags. Oh, and they carry Kendra Scott at this location now. I got this one online. I finally hit the bullet. I've been wanting this one for the absolutely longest, and I finally got it. But this one's gorgeous. And then they have a lot of the Kurt Geiger ones. Um, let's see. I like that one. This one's new, but I feel like this one you could literally catch a charge because it's like, like, it's so spiky. 
and then that one's new, that transparent one. Got kids made handbags, but all these right here. I think Dillard's is doing the exact same thing as Macy's, where they're having like outlet, like these are outlet style bags, and they're being sold for full price, which I think is a little crazy. I never thought they would ever do something like that. This one's super cute as well. The Marc Jacobs bags there. All those Dillard's card members beat me to it yesterday, but all these are just kind of more of the other brands that Dillard's carry. They don't really have Coach or Brahmin here, over here. But yeah, there's usually a couple Marc Jacobs bags, but they all seem to be absolutely gone. I don't see any of them, so I'm really, really sad, but there are like the little cute bags if you do want to go for them. And they have this one in this beautiful green color. And they have the classic editor toe, but the older style, not the new one. Then they have this one in the larger one, the Kiss Me. But look how pretty this suede color is. This suede is absolutely gorgeous. Like, I've been wanting a Camly color, so that's why I finally hit the bullet and bought the tabby one. This one's $3.50. I think this is like a super elevated handbag for $3.50. I think it's super gorgeous and I love the back pocket of it. They have a quilted one. Then they have this little pillow in this green color. And then the rose gold snapshot. I have the tote. So I just bought the green one. I don't think I've showed it on YouTube yet. But I'm actually going to be doing a, a review on totes really, really soon. But um, they have these two ones and the larger ones. For me, I just felt like the large ones were a little bit too large. And the smaller one fit my laptop. So I think that one was better. And they have a crossbody strap. Or like a shoulder or crossbody. And these ones, you can't make them. And then... I love this one right here, the one that I got as well. And then they have that beaded one up there, and then they have another snapshot. And this beaded one right here is $500. But yeah, I just, my viewers, we were just talking. We both came in here for the Marc Jacobs bags, but we couldn't find any. So we're a little bummed out, <laughs> but we started talking a little bit. And it's always great to chit chat because, you know, we get each other. We know what we like to talk about. We love Marc Jacobs, we love our favorite brands, and we kind of kiki about it. But I didn't find any of it. So I think I'm gonna look at the glasses and the shoes and kind of go from there. But I'm so sad that there wasn't really a lot of thinning is made. I had a great conversation. And I'm gonna look at the eyewear and then we're gonna go into Macy's, but I definitely need un cafecito. That's I feel like something that I definitely need. Let's see where this cell eyewear is. These are cute. I found these ones. Only 40% off of them. But same thing guys. I think there's up there was just nothing to begin with or everything sold out yesterday. Pero casi no tienen nada de, de lentes también. Get any luck here guys. I got my pumpkin spice latte. Sorry, Joe, secret. Uh, let's see if we find anything here. If not, I feel like I have still haven't checked the woman's ready to wear at Dillard's. And I all checked the footwear. So we'll see what we'll find. But usually I like coming to Macy's. I like coming to this Macy's because I feel like they always have a really good selection. They don't have any, so that's crazy. Look at the way. They're like double censored guys. Like look at that. Ain't nobody taking this bomb and wallet. Nobody is. So it has a sensor and it's cable two times. And it's a $155 wallet. Same thing. Two sensors, a cable. Same thing for this one. No one's gonna be stealing this handbag. Pretty Juni Burke bag. Like look how cute this color is. Like I love, I saw Hydro Flask did a, a flask in this color and I'm like literally obsessed with it. This one's one I need. It's not that bad, but it's really pretty though. Like it's really, really pretty. But I consider that more of a spring bag, but I'm not really sure. This clutch looks like the Jimmy Choo candy clutch. Like it literally looks just like it. And it's $30. Look at their coach handbags just to see what they have. So they have this really pretty orangey color. And I like how you can adjust the straps on this one. And I like the little more of the kind of that muted hardware versus it's the shiny shiny. This one's 
up this one. I'm not the biggest fan of the pipeline because I feel like you, it would show wear really easily because um, it's like the pipeline of the balance. So I feel like you would be worse. So I'm not the biggest fan of this one. The classic. See, I like the pipeline on that one that matches it. And see, I prefer this one, even though it's white, I prefer the orange because the orange is, to be honest, it's what's gonna show the most wear on it. They have that blue one on so Dillard's, but I do like this one right here. Two fourteen. And they have all those uh, maroon tabby wallets for ninety, and the snakeskin ones for one seventeen. And then they have the classic um, black ones for sixty dollars right there. That's a really great deal for a classic black. You would think that the maroon would go on so before the other one. I'm not the biggest fan of monogram bags in general, but I do like this blue one here. I think it's super cute. Like I love the C with the blue fabric. Look at that, the little sweet material too. Remind me of the Givenchy bags that they did last year. Floral tabby. This one's really pretty. I think this was the Mother's Day edition one. And they did like uh, another version of the tabby as well. And then they have this bucket bag right here with a little scallop detail. And it has a, a little turn lock. And it, oh, the really pretty tan. I do like that a lot. $3.50. And then they have my OG Coach Cassie 19. Love this bag so much. They have it in the black. The classic kind of bucket bag. I think, yeah, they're the Charlie bucket bag. And they have it in the larger size. I prefer the smaller one. I've been really into either big, big bags or small, small, small bags. And then they have this kind of classic C bag too. And this is the Parker. Yeah, Parker shoulder bag. Are these little nylon bags on sale? You know, nylon has been back, has been more popular in 140, so it's really easy to make nylon, um, like to produce it. So I like that they're a really great price point, and you also get that 30% off. And they also have it in the cosmetic bag, the backpack, and kind of like this larger one. And these are actual paper turn locks. But I also love me at the end of the day a good classic black one. Little black one, 65. This is a little silver one here. And then they have it like in a hobo y style as well. Um, not sure if I feel a lot, a lot about the nylon -y. I mean, I like it, but I definitely not the biggest fan of it. I definitely prefer some of the other lines of it. Maybe it's the way. I think for me, I don't really like this. I wish this was like a little bit more daintier. Other than that, I do like it. I don't know, maybe that's why. Some of the coach books that they've been kind of having out. Some of the new ones here, like a lot of the monogram ones. The Cassie, the the kind of classic shoulder bag. Some Cassie 19 from the monogram. And this kind of tan color. And then this white one with the little floral, which is a little Parker. So, oh, they're all kind of color coordinated. I've always liked this one too. I'm not gonna lie actually less it's it's 325 i think little tabbies are 350 so this is like a little bit less like i said not the biggest monogram person but i do i like i said if you watch other vlogs i've always been a fan of this kind of canvas theme this is a really pretty bag super versatile and it definitely gives me early 2000 back out vibes i see a lot of people with the cassie bags but to be honest in texas i don't really see a lot of tabbies around like every time I see a tabby, I get so excited on a person, but I don't really see them too, too frequently. Let's walk and then here's some fabric bags, but let's actually walk downstairs and see if they actually have any designer bags, because sometimes they do. 
at the Macy's bag stage. So actually, let's go ahead and go do that since we're here. For a second, when I saw this bag, I was like, oh my god, is that a Christian Louboutin bag from like a distance? But it's a little guest bag. I don't know. The Kavada to has the Christian Louboutin Kavada to has that little red sole. That's very to that brand. Oh my god, so they do have some stuff. So they have a Saint Laurent bag. They have oh my god, it's a really pretty yellowy color. Let's see how much it is. It's fifteen hundred dollars, guys. That's insane. Fifteen hundred dollars for that bag. This Kino belts right here, and this one's one eighty, and then this one's two hundred. I definitely prefer the OG, and I do like that color of Gemini Link little wristlet, little Michael Kors. I believe they have like a single one, like a yellow bag. That's crazy. So cute. This reminds me of a Stott bag. So the Dillard's outlet is doing 40% off as well because it said outlets were included. So if you guys want to check out, I would also check out the outlets. Look how pretty that fuzzy jacket is from Free People. It's really cute. But yeah, one of my other favorite brands that I love to check out at Dillard's is Free People. I think sometimes they have some really great items like these shorts. I mean, these ones are a little too short for my tasting, but 23 bucks. And you get that 40% off. So you get them under $15 with tax. Look at these free people jeans. 27. 32. 24. Yeah, they didn't really have a lot. Um, I went to another Dillard's last weekend because I had to do some errands and, and I wanted to go to the Nordstrom Rack there. Um, and they actually had some bags. So I got to see what their selection was prior. So I wonder if they have anything left there. But I really like this jacket. Mankind, Levi's, Eileen Fisher, Ralph Lauren, not Polo Ralph Lauren. I think they have some really great stuff. North Face, from time to, from time, to time you, find, you may find some great deals. Great stuff on sale. Since they do tend to have like a lot of coats over here. Oh, 40% off, and then you get an additional 40. I I heard that the Dillard sale, I heard that they had a huge sale at the North Face Outlet in Allen, like a sample sale, and that it was really popular. I do like this jacket a lot. I have it in black, but I feel like I have so many things in black. But I do like this contrast right here. They have a size medium. This is absolutely, so, I really like the color of it, and I like the back of it too. I'm gonna try this puppy on. I don't really like it on anymore. I feel like there's a kind of like under boob on it, but I do like the little pockets on it. I'm gonna try on the size large just to see how it fits. For the large one a lot better i like that oversized feel of it it's super cute but i don't know how you feel about like the opening on the side here it's a really cute jacket but i wish this was more stitched in because i feel like this has more bulk so i feel like it's not as flattering i really like the color though i think the color doesn't get it true on camera or my cell phone but it's really pretty <laughs> I, you, you can get the doer look for less because it has a little pocket here. This one is $30 and it's 40% off, so it'd be um, 18 bucks. This one's super cute. I probably wouldn't wear it all the way, collar it up. I would probably kind of fold it inward like that. I'm not gonna lie, this is this would look sickening with like a cute like black legging and just kind of running and doing your errand, especially this little pocket here. Cause you can just put all your little stuff in here. Oh, and it also has a zip. Oh, it has something else to it. But this is super cute. I think you can fold the jacket inside of here. I think that's what, what it is. But this is kind of a cute jacket. I'm not going to lie. Looks like I'm pregnant. Look, I'm having my non-existent child. Oh my god, this three people jacket is everything too. I love the colors. It's green and kind of camely color. Oh, and I still like that fuzzy one. Let's see what they look like on the models. 
gorgeous. I do like this free. I've been liking the way free people have been doing their items lately. In the past, not so much, but recently I think they've been knocking it out of the ballpark. It's big shoes, super cute little glittery moments. Oh, so let's look at the Kurt Geiger, because that's what we love here, the Kurt Geiger suits. These are new, look at them. <laughs> I've, been, I've literally been dropping everything. Look at these Kurt Geiger shoes with the little bird with the studs. Super elevated. Look at that. These are really pretty. I do like Kurt Geiger shoes. I like these, which I, every single time I see them, I always say I like them. Those, those, those two. That's a very simple classic one. Look at these little boots. Like you see the little sparkles in them, and they're actually a hound's tooth with rhinestones on them. So 175. And I like the little block heel on them too, so they make them super walkable. Little strappy moment. Put the ones with the bird. 149. I do like the Kurt Geiger shoes. They all look elevated. Probably the sneakers are not my favorite, but all the other shoes I do like. I think they're super, super elevated. And I feel like you can dress them up and down. Person. I do like those little booties right here. These two right here. Steve Madden boots. They don't have a tag, but they're 65 plus the 40. This one carried coat shoes. I feel like a long time ago they did, but I feel like they don't anymore. These are 45. These are Ghani Beanie. Johnny Beanie. These are cute. The little white ones. Those are gorgeous. 50. So these be $30. The Sam Edelman shoes. I've been obsessed with a lot of the Sam Edelman shoes. The way right here with a little cheetah print. I feel like now that I found that Ghani um, cheetah jacket or like a shirt, I've been obsessed with cheetah or leopard. I've just been obsessed with it like a million times more. And they also have these little heels and have the little kind of furry details on them. And the kind of classic ballet flat, the classic white sneaker. I feel like Sam Edelman has like a lot of core things like that you can add into your wardrobe <gasps> i love these look at these little square toe moment little emblem super minimal discreet clean what do you guys think i like the contrast of the brown with the black versus it being an all black shoe this is our 149 oh and they are waterproof too and then these ones and then they have the classic riding boot as well. How do you feel about a riding boot, guys? I don't have one in my collection, but I'm not supposed to adding one into my collection either. Super soft. I told you guys Christmas comes early every year. Like, look at this holiday packaging. Christmas is right around the corner before you know it. And the preparation for that process has already started. So Dillard's now carries St. Laurent handbags, but the thing is, these are more the resale price. So it's $24.50, I believe that's what it retails for. Maybe it just had a little bit of a price increase. And they have these two cape bags. Look how pretty they are. They look better in person, but like the color is definitely gravitating for it. Sometimes it doesn't catch the entire color. And they have some Louis Vuitton bags. Like that is really pretty multicolor one. You just kind of boop, boop, open up. Really pretty. And a little Trivoli. And a few more right here, that a little bit more of the older style. This one's really cute. I like the little red. How it, I know it's a lining, but it just kind of peeps out. The thing is, I just think that the, I just think that the, what comes around goes around is a little overpriced in my opinion. And then they have this little, this little speedy for a thousand one hundred and five. I think that's a little insane. We have this one here. This one's a thousand sixty. A little Palis BB. I think this is the Bria GM. Bria MM. 25. And the Vanny. And the this one is. 14.25. And then they have the Steven Sprouts one. And then they have this little um, cape ball for 13.75. The Steven Sprout one is $3,500. 
and they have this little Epi one. Three. I believe the time box here. This one's 507. This one has a pouch and it's a little transparent, like kind of epi moment. I have a little Fendi right there. And then this Fendi baguette I had already looked at. It's $600. And they have this one here. This one's $850. It's a little monogram. And it's a little bit of the fabric lining on the inside. And then some Gucci bags. And little Gucci Soho, I think the, this one's super overpriced. I had looked at it before, and it's a thousand seventy-five. And then they have um, some little SOGs. They usually have a little bit more. So they have a little Gucci Marmont, a little Louis Vuitton one, a Gucci wallet, and Balenciaga. But yeah, guys, this is Dillard's. They didn't really have a lot. So sad because I always feel like I missed a Dillard sale. So I went ahead and got a Dillard's card. Um, I'm probably that's the only time I would ever actually use it is just to shop the sale early because I want to show you guys the best content and everything. So like there's usually a lot of Marchica's bags and Kate Spade. But the thing is the sale started yesterday and you know those Dillard's card members play no games. <laughs> They're always the first one. So no, I will not miss the sale and I can show you some of the great stuff that's in the Dillard sale for card members. So I'm super, super excited and I have a 10% off cost. So next time I could... Next time I'll get 10% off my entire purchase. Ooh, I love this bag right here. This little tabby camely color. Guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the video here. And I'll see you guys in the car. It's my little shopping trip with you guys. Oh my god, I have like so much to talk about with you guys. I know it's a little bit dark, but I think we'll be fine. So yeah, so I got my cafecito. I ended up getting a Dillage credit card, which is something I've never thought I would actually say out of my mouth. Just because I'm not the biggest fan of getting store credit cards. Um, I'm just not. Like, I'd rather put everything on a Chase credit card or American Express credit card, but... I got one and basically the only reason why I got it is so I can shop the Dillard so early because I feel like I always miss out on the contemporary handbags when they go like 65 plus 15 all those great deals and I have a feeling you know how New Year's Eve they have that 50% off so it wouldn't be surprising because of you know because of the situation that we're in now that they may split it into two days or that card members can shop early it wouldn't surprise me at all and so who knows so you know I decided to get it the only reason I got it was to shop the sale early I, pro I would probably never use it like if I go some random day that I don't have to use my card I would just honestly just use it to kind of get that the prices early and then just pay the item off the moment that you know it gets posted on my account but yeah we went to Dillard's they did have some coach bags that were on sale but nothing too too much and but they did have a lot of shoes I will say Dillard's always has their great shoe sale and they always have a lot of great um, clothing especially for men's and then coach and then Macy's had like a lot of new of the coach arrivals which I always love to see and looking at some of the Marc Jacobs like I love that Marc Jacobs um, suede bag this one right here oh that one's really pretty like that color of tan is like absolutely gorgeous but yeah guys I literally have not film like a little vlog in the longest so I just wanted to come here and chit chat and talk with you guys I feel like this is so uh it's so relaxing just to talk to you guys because I feel like it's been such a long time that I actually get in front of a, like a camera and like actually vlog and I miss it so much but starting next week everything will be perfectly fine and i'm so excited to see and get ready and preparation of all my fall content and all my um winter content because that's my favorite time of the year is fall and winter like i love wearing jackets i love wearing turtlenecks i love wearing boots like that is me absolutely the favorito temporada del absolutely año i don't really like the hot as much but i'm so so excited guys to be bringing you guys along thank you thank you so much everyone has been supporting me but there is a lot of things that are in the works and I can't wait to start making those announcements as early as next week and I can't really thank you guys enough for all the love and the support Ugh, I just cannot Dillard's card like Toya so absolutely shocked I texted my friend I was like oh my god I got a Dillard's card she's like shut up Sergio no you didn't and then I sent a picture of it and 
I didn't get one, so um, I just want the early access to get all those good handbag sales. So if any of you guys have a dealer's card, let me know. Do you actually get really great stuff before it's actually more public? Because I would always have to wait public, or sometimes I'll vlog when it's on sale, like the card holder sale day, but I can't actually purchase anything, which actually sucks. So I have to wait till the next day, or you know, usually if you go in the morning, the things will be sold out by that entire day. Because especially like those Kate Spade, Coach, and Mark Jacobs bag, when they hit 50 or 65, and then you also get that additional 40 percent off that's actually like the best time to buy those handbags so let me know know if it's actually worth it but yeah guys thank you thank you so much for watching this video and i'm going through a tunnel and i'm about to see the light next week and i'm just waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting and i just want to say thank you guys enough like i cannot thank you I feel so relieved. I feel like all these, all this weight's gonna be lifted off my shoulders. And yeah, thank you, you guys, and thank you to everyone that's been helping me through this little process that I've been going through. And yeah, guys, I love each and every single one of you, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye, guys.